Okay, I'm in one of the secondhand stores and I'm gonna browse through this area. Uh, I'm gonna try to say prices or show prices. But this is one of the locations that seem like it's pretty good. Okay. This table is $79.99, but this table is $59.99, and I like that. I would, if I needed a table, I would probably try to get it, and I probably wouldn't hesitate. But really, I'm just going to browse in here real quick. I'm going to try to say some prices, like that vase right there is $34.99. Now that's sort of vase that, matter of fact, a vase that I could use for my color scheme, but I'm not worried about that right now. And that's why I do, I'm do. i doing mainly window shopping because I don't need to be buying anything right now. But I, I do, I can look and I don't have a problem looking. And I just like, sometimes I, for me just to get over the urge to even want to buy something, just doing some window shopping is enough for me. Now this couch, now I'm surprised, I ain't gonna lie. This couch is $89, it looks pretty decent. Matter of fact, let me see how much this is. $30 for that rack. I wouldn't mind having that rack, but I'm not worried about it. And let me see how much this sectional is. It looks pretty decent. It's two hundred dollars, one ninety nine. The chair by itself, but it seems like uh, nah. It probably doesn't go with it. It looks like it, but I can tell by the difference in the color. The main thing that I like getting at uh, secondhand stores is furniture, pieces of furniture or anything of that nature. Now that's not bad, $50, $49.99, and this ain't, ooh, ooh. Even if it's not real hard, it still feels like it. And that's $49. Let's see, something like this, to me, this is worth $30, like I said. I don't need it. Oh, I wouldn't pay a hundred dollars for that. For that dresser for nothing in the world. And the thing about it is, I mean it's probably some solid wood and strong, but the look of it is not my something that I'd want. Now having it for necessities, that would be okay. Now this is so cute. This is cute. And but I like this um uh, while I'm looking at the what's on the top, now I like stuff like this. Now it's eighty-nine dollars, and to me, eighty-nine dollars I would pay for it. I would pay that for it. Let me get. Let me see if I can get a price on this, cause this. Oh, this is heavy. It's only eleven ninety-nine. That's not bad at all. I'm really surprised they got it for eleven ninety-nine. I really am. Now that's cute, and this would be cute in a children's room, a little boy. Okay, I'm gonna look at these couches real quick. Okay, this couch, now this looks like more like a, more like maybe an antique style couch. Um, it, but it's only $89.99, that's not bad. I thought they would have had that in there for way more than that. Now this chair by itself, they want $79 for it. See? That's why I'm surprised at the other cat. This couch is 149, and to me, you know, I just—it's not—and and you might not be able to tell, but it's like a hunter green, and it's just—it's not my taste at all. But you know what I've learned—that if you have to get some furniture that you don't necessarily like, just get some covers for it, some material to put a cover over it. Now, 89—that's not bad. Not my kind of kind of style either. And I don't think I've ever purchased a, purchased a piece of furniture that I had to do something like that with. I just used it for what it was. 
Okay, I'm going to skim over here. I just can't not come in here when I was right at another store. But you know, you come in these stores and you find all kind of stuff. And this is one of the ones I think is better. Now, this, you, I mean, come on. This is $22.99 good price. If I if if my daughter was still small, I would probably would have snatched it up. But that's why I end up having too much stuff in the first place, because I'm always snatching something up. But you know how it goes when you like things like like to do stuff like this. See, now these chairs look decent. But they want $39.99 per chair. But I'ma just skim over this table real quick. Just to show you that the table by itself, now that's not bad. It pro I wonder if it has uh, has any pieces to go in the middle, because I know that's the type of table it is. But anyway, I'm just talking. Oh, now this table. Oh my God. But look how much they want for it. $799 for a used table. And you probably got the chairs to go with it. It's got six chairs. But you know, anyway, that's why I just come in and do my look, look around, and then I come, and if I see something that I gotta have, then okay. But I tell you what I'm about to look at real quick. I'm about to look at these doggone scarves. But if they, in, if they are too high, cause I'm one of those people, sometimes you come to these secondhand stores and their prices are just as high as places like you know, what you would consider the discount stores. See, I've been to secondhand stores where when it comes to scarves, they'll just charge like a dollar for them. You know, these scarves is, anyway, I know somebody probably might look and say, well, those are nice scarves. Well, look at here, it's used regardless. But they don't went up on these um, prices. Matter of fact, I guess I could find out what, well, I don't think they really have the discount here. But anyway, see, that's, that's why you have to be ready for some of the items that you see and some of the prices you see. Now, most of the time, by the time I get out of the, um, furniture section it's kind of hard for me to keep going if that's what I kind of really wanted to come in here and look at but I'm gonna skim over the, oh you know what I kind of do need a change purse and I need to kind of see what the prices are on these or bill for the whatever you want to call it I just need something simple but I'm not gonna worry about it today like I don't mind paying for a few a few dollars for those because right now I need one because my other one is has so much so much stuff in it just bust it busted open and the doggone um zipper is messed up let's see it's probably after eight o'clock well, look at those shoes up there. Those are nice. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to find the price on it because I know I know that's not my size. $10.99. But those are nice looking shoes. Size 11. I'm not going to necessarily look in the clothes, but I will kind of skim over the shoes. Well, those are cute. Six ninety nine, six and a half. I need to find me some black shoes. Maybe some slide-ons or something that has a little heel to it. I hadn't had a pair in a while. And I need some new ones. Ooh, those are cute sandals. Those are cute. Nine ninety nine. Would I pay that for them? I don't know. It just depends. It depends. 
Okay, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to go down the whole aisle of the shoes. I know back in the day when you go to a place like this, uh, all the shoes was one price. You see, they like to change stuff around. Okay. So, oh my gosh, I see something I need. Oh, they got Mickey Mouse up. Mini and Mickey Mouse. Okay, now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go, let me see, am I going to go down this aisle? I don't think so. Not today. I'm going to just make a quick look down the aisle, but this isn't my type of aisle necessarily, but I do like candle, candle holders. I do like candle holders, but I don't need any right now. And I don't want to waste time when I can be looking at something else right now in my section that I like to look in. Okay, more furniture. Now, for somebody that might would have wanted a file cabinet, $10. Now, that's not bad. Excuse me, ma'am. Excuse me, ma'am. Yes, Is there anything on sale today? Are you the lady that you? Oh, you the lady that works next door. How are you doing today? Good. How are you? I'm doing good. Um. Friday lunch on Thursday. Fifty-five and over. Oh no. And if you're ready to for the army, uh huh. Okay, but the only other way is with the um, like when we bring stuff in. You've been doing all right. <sighs> Hanging in there. It's weird. My uh, boys were just gone, like, going to fade away. So back there we had tea and ginger. I had oh. some of that. Now I feel a little better. Oh, I love but some ginger. You. Well, I was afraid I never had it before. I'm like, ooh. So I tried oh, it's strong it now. Oh, it's strong. Oh, mine. You took care of my throat. Yeah, it will clear some stuff up. It works. Okay, let's see. Okay, here we go. Uh huh. Four item of clothes and get the fifth item as the court. Okay. But that's for clothing. Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right. But you have to show us on your phone though. Oh, that special? Mm -hmm. On your phone. In, so it comes from the website? Mm -hmm. Okay. If, you, if you're on the VIP uh -huh. and you get emails all the time, okay. you see that every month, you get that. Okay. Yeah. And your hair looks good. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Uh, I do like looking at the dishes, but they don't really have. Let me see. I'm going to skim them over here real quick. Oh, look at this. This would come in handy for somebody that those places that they might like need this kind of stuff. I want to see how much this is. That's cute. Oh, that's the price. $7.99 ain't bad. I'm surprised it's not higher than that. Okay, is that a shredder? Yeah, that's a shredder. That's not too, uh, that's not too bad. That's a big one. I've never seen one that dog on size. Look how big that is. It's $24.99. It might be kind of pricey for the second hand store, but at the same time, uh, those shredders come in handy. Oh, that's a water, uh, the water machine to put the water uh, jugs in. See what kind of vacuum cleaners and floor cleaners they have over here. Oh, they got a pretty good amount over here. 
Now I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. 42. See, they trying to get money for them shorts. <laughs> Let me see how much this shit is. The Bissell. 21. See, the Bissell is even cheaper than the dollar on shorts. That means you might as well take the shorts. It is about twice as much. Now, this third devil is $12.99. Oh, look at this. What is this? This is a or uh, 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 Yeah, I remember I came across stuff like this in secondhand stores. 17. Oh, that's probably a regular uh, vacuum cleaner. Anyway, I'm going to, uh, oh, these are cute. Skim over these uh, tote bags. I see $12.99 on the black one. And let me see. Different prices. Like I said back in the day, $6.99. I don't really use tote bags. You know, when you start getting to another level. Uh, how you do things makes sense. Oh, here's a lot of exercise uh, equipment. You don't you don't always see a lot of that or a, a lot of that in some of the stores like this. Now I'm gonna go over here to this machine. Oh, that look like it's barely been used. It probably they probably just package it up. It's only twenty dollars. I don't know what it is, but it's twenty dollars. Oh, look at this cooler. Now that's cute. I ain't never seen a cooler that color. Seven ninety nine. I pay seven ninety nine for it. That's a nice size cooler. I, oh, is this a mat? But they want fifty. I want y'all to see this dog on price. It's crazy. You want you want fifteen ninety nine for a used mat in a dog room? I mean, come on now. Let me see what the price is on this one. Some stuff is just ridiculous, but you know I have to voice my opinion. I really do. When I see that kind of stuff, I just I just have to say something. Even if I just had a thought coming through my mind. Okay, I don't see a price on this machine, so I'm I'm not gonna worry about it. I'm not going to worry about it. Oh. Toys. Baby stuff. It's getting dark outside. I'm going to skim over. This is my section right here. Stuff like this. And what I came from with the, the plates, the dishes, kitchenware. I'm going to skim down the aisle. I could go down the aisle real quick, but I'm going to leave it alone. I see some of this stuff, like I see a sprinkler. You know, it's kind of like miscellaneous items that sometimes when you actually take time to go down that aisle, you find some stuff that you need. Okay, this is like the electronics. I'm not going to go down that aisle because I'll see something that I want to look at and don't need to. See, they got plenty of irons in here. I don't normally see that a lot. Okay. Bread maker, $15.99. What is this right here? That looks like a Panini uh, grill. Let me see how much they want for it, just for the hell of it. $20. Yeah, because I got one. But it's not like this one, but I think that's about. Oh. No, this is a George Foreman grill. And if I'm not mistaken, I might be wrong. But anyway, they look like it's, uh, it looks like it's the same. I, w I would take the time to try to look. Yeah, that's it. That's it. That's his, that's his stuff. You know what, is this a timer? I kinda think I need a, uh, oh no, that's a, that's a scale. But what if I wanted it? I just wanna see what the price is, $6.99. Even though I feel like it probably could be cheaper than that, if I needed it, I'd get it. Sometimes I'm just like, okay. Oh, that's an ice cream maker. 
There is a, a juicer. Now, I tell you what, if I needed a juicer, which I don't, because I got one or two. When I say that's nothing but, and that's the older dude, that, uh, he's probably gone now. Uh, the Jack Lantern, $30, but it probably still works good. Let me see how much this ice cream maker is, $14.99. See, that's something you don't mind paying $14.99, $15 for. Oh. See, that's why I don't like them coming down all of the aisles because I'm not really looking for stuff. Okay, first of all, let me let me show you this. I don't know what it is, but it's a Cuisinart, and I like Cuisinart. And it's twenty dollars. So let me see if I can find out what it is. Cause I'm thinking that it might be one of those vegetable shredders. But it doesn't necessarily look like it. It looks funny. It's not something that I'm used to seeing. Because I know that the vegetable shredders look kind of different. Dang, I wouldn't mind what that is, knowing what that is. But right now I'm not gonna I'm not gonna uh ponder on it. I see they got a lot of the grilling machines in here. 